directly on Minecraft Story Mode. Everything in the universe starts out as just a block. What comes of those blocks is up to those who wield them. And in every block, there lies the potential to create or destroy. Our friends have traveled far and wide in search of the Order of the Stone. And a way to stop the Wither Storm for good. But even well laid plans can go awry. The strong can grow weak. And beloved heroes can fall. threat to this world, to its very existence, is far from over. Witherstorm isn't dead yet, not even close. The what? Do I know you? Jesse, Jesse, where are you? Say something, Jesse! We're over here! No way, no way! You found Petra? Who is Petra? Petra? Your missing friend? Look out! Ah! Those Endermen are running the wrong way! They'll be killed! Soren? I can't stand by and watch! I'd be condemning them to death! Soren, what do you think you're doing? These Endermen are running directly into danger! You're putting us in danger every second you just stand there! Jesse! They're falling behind! Axel, you gotta move faster! He's too sick. This is the best we can do. They're not gonna be able to outrun it. Not on foot! We gotta find a way to move faster. We're all gonna be caught in the tractor beam. We need transportation. Anyone seen a minecart? I think Axel still has one from the nether, but it won't help. We need to lay down too much track. We'll have to use the next best thing. Everybody, get on! They can just hang on. I'll take Gabriel. Then I've got Petra. Hold on, this might be a bumpy ride. <laughs> Come on, horses! Whatever you do, don't look back. Ah! I look. Everyone follow me! This is the Jesse, worst ride look out. of my life! It's gaining on us! Pick up the pace or we're all done for! First time on a horse here! Sorry. Sorry. 
ship, Jesse. Is that what this is called? <gasps> made it. Jesse, Petra was saying some pretty weird stuff back on that horse. She was inside the wither. She might have wither sickness. I don't know. You never acted the way she's been acting. I'll go talk to her. Hey, how are you feeling? I don't really feel like myself. I still can't believe you're even alive. Do you not recognize us? I'm Axel. This is Olivia. She doesn't know us. Any of us. But we've known her for... Practically forever. I know. I, I, I know, but look at her. Jesse, this is awful. You, Jesse. You're the one who rescued me. Tell me. Please, what is going on? All I remember was endless blackness. You were caught in the Witherstorm for a long time, Petra. Really? I can't remember any of it. All I know is, I was so scared in there. I thought for sure I was dying. Well, you didn't. You made it back alive. We didn't all make it back, though. Magnus. For a second there, I almost forgot. Are we talking about Magnus? Yeah. Oh, Magnus. Couldn't believe it then. Still can't believe it. How? How could this have happened? To lose not just a friend, but a member of the Order of the Stone! He knew the risks, and still he let me take his armor. He was so brave. He was also incredibly stupid, but still, so brave. Indeed. Ah! Being emotional is getting us nowhere! What I want to know is what happened out there today. Why is that thing still alive? My instructions were simple. The Formidabomb just wasn't strong enough. I mean, it ripped the Witherstorm apart, but it didn't make a dent in the command block. So the command block is still out there? Of course it is! Oh, great! And now, to make matters worse, we've gone from one wither storm to three! Our plan was a total failure! I should have cast the foul thing into the abyss. Look, our plan didn't work, so we obviously need a new one. The question is, what do we do? Well, why are you asking me? Am I expected to know every last thing in the universe? <sighs> I need a moment to think. Is he always like this? You have no idea. That jacket, it looks familiar. Lucas always wears that jacket. No, 
I saw other people wearing it when I was being thrown from that dead monster. Ugh. Even thinking about it hurts. Hey, hey, it's okay. Jesse, if what Petra said is true, I mean, do you think? I thought for sure they were gone, but... Lucas, your friends could still be out there! I know, and that means I... I gotta go after them. They might need me, Jesse. <gasps> the room. Everything's spinning. It's okay. Easy does it. Gravel? No. Dirt? Don't think so. Lucas, what are you doing? I told you. I'm going after my friends. I thought the other ocelots were dead. But if they're not, I need to go find them. Look, I am grateful to you guys for bringing me this far. You can't just up and leave, Lucas. You're part of our team. And you saying that just reminds me that I left my team. But Lucas... Look, you and me, we've made a pretty good team so far. I'd even call us friends. So I hope you'll understand why I need to go help my old friends. They do it for me. Same way you'd go back for any of your friends. I can't believe I'm saying this, but if your heart's telling you to go, then you gotta go. Otherwise, you'd be heartless or something. <laughs> Thank you, Jesse. I'll find them. And then I'll find you again, too. I promise. Thanks. You came along. Just don't tell Reuben I said that. He might get jealous. Some leftover cobblestone might come in handy. Jesse. Better, Gabriel? Better is relative. A battle with a wither storm sapped the last of my strength. Considerable though it was. You need to rest. You're right, I do. Look, Jesse, wherever you decide to go after this cave, give him some time to get his strength back. Problem is, we don't have time. Jesse's right. In fact, it. Might be best if my journey ends here. This cave is safe, easy to defend. It's relatively comfortable. I might even find a shred of peace. Ugh, I don't know. This group keeps losing people. First Magnus, and now Lucas just left? Oh? I'm sorry, Jesse. I wish I were stronger. <sighs> Nothing had to turn out like this. If the Order had just been different, if we'd made smarter choices, Ivor wouldn't have turned into a maniac and... Well, maybe Magnus would still be alive. Let's just let bygones be bygones. You guys did your best. Whatever happened back then, you can't blame yourselves for it. Things were complicated then, Jesse. But I appreciate you saying that. All this talk of the past has me exhausted. You need to rest. Will he be okay? I honestly don't know. Just get back out there and kick some butt for the both of us. Hey, buddy. You doing okay? Of course you are. I wish I could say the same for everyone else. Petra, how are you doing? Are you remembering things yet? I... I don't know. These little flashes keep coming back to me, but then they float away again. 
We've been trying to talk to her, but... It's like she's never met us before. I know I've met you before. Before today, I mean. I just don't remember how exactly. I keep seeing a dark alley. You totally came to my rescue in the forest, remember? I think that pig was there, right? Uh, Reuben, yes. And he was better at fighting than you, right? Uh, hey, I, I wouldn't say that. Yes, it's working. You're remembering Jesse. Do you remember me, too? No. And yet, I feel like I know all of you, somehow. Maybe it's the way you're dressed. Something's ringing a bell. Of course you know us. We're the Order of the Pig. The Order of the Pig? Wait, didn't we all fight that wither thing together? Yes! We totally did. She remembers it. I remember running to a, a, a temple in the woods, and we were going to be safe there. And how did I end up inside that thing? Oh, uh, well, something bad happened there. I, I couldn't save you. Things were happening so fast, and it, that thing was powerful. Well, thank you for trying. Um... Sure. All that matters is you're with us now. And that you're still a fighter. The best one I know. So, what do you say? Will you be part of our group again? All right. Count me in. Ugh. A pig? <laughs> Reuben! Don't run off on me like that, okay? I don't want to lose you, you understand? <laughs> Things are different now. We've lost too many people already. Our group is cracking, Reuben. You're right. We are just like the Order. That's what I said, isn't it? Oh, just as you once helped us before. This isn't about the past. It's about the future. just needs to rest for a while. how dangerous it is. Oh, the bitter irony. Soren, you need to listen to me. Oh, what good has ever come of that? Would you both stop arguing, please? Oh, no, this isn't an argument. It's me trying to make Ivor leave us alone. I told you, I wouldn't have followed you here without good reason. What you don't understand is, you are all in very grave danger. <laughs> Obviously! No, I mean specifically this group. The Witherstorm isn't acting randomly. It's following Gabriel. Gabriel? You see, I may have programmed it to follow his amulet. You mean the Order's amulet? Oh, don't be so dramatic. Did you also know I was the one he gave the amulet to? What? I... I didn't know. Ah, <sighs> Ivor, you fool. You've created a monster that's following Jesse, and it's only getting stronger. You don't think I realize that? Nothing can stop those things. Nothing even hurts them. Well, 
Except Enderman. Enderman? Jesse's right. The Wither's gaze passed over them. Soren, do you think Enderman could actually destroy one of those things? Well, it's not beyond imagination. If there were enough of them working together, it's a promising concept, at least in theory. So it is possible? Yes. Yes, I, I think it might be. We'd simply need to get a large group of them into the storm's vicinity. In fact, there's probably more than enough of them still in my fortress. An unintended side effect of you flooding the end. This is just like the old days, Soren. You and your crazy ideas... Hush, Ivor, for once! Huh. Question is, how to bring the Storms and the Endermen together? Endermen aren't pets. They don't follow orders. We know for a fact the Wither Storm will follow the Amulet, so if we take the Amulet back to your fortress where the Endermen are... Yes! Yes, that's it! We'll lead them straight into a massive trap! If we can't bring the Endermen to the Witherstorms, we bring the Witherstorms to the Endermen. Just one problem. You're forgetting about the command block! Ugh, oh, yes. It's clear now that no weapon can destroy it. Not even a Formidabomb. Actually, I may have a solution to that. You see, when I first took possession of the command block... You mean, stole it? Yes, well, I created a failsafe. A backup plan, for just in case. What kind of fail-safe, exactly? An enchanting book. One that contains the power of the command block itself. Use it to enchant a weapon, and you'll be able to smash the command block to bits. Forever! Yes. Yes, that's it! It could very well solve all our problems. What are we waiting for? Let's go get that book! Just one problem. It's at my secret lab, which is sort of far away. How far could it possibly be? Let's just say it's the farthest place a person can travel before being utterly... Oh dear, what was that? How did it find us so quickly? It just keeps coming for us. Well, we can't stand around and wait for it. Guys, there's a reason it's been following us. Ivor says it's because of the amulet that Gabriel... Ivor? Well, I'll be. It is you. A pleasure, as always, Eligard. Anyway, Ivor's figured out the Witherstorms are drawn to the amulet, so we're gonna lure them back to Soren's fortress and destroy the command block with an enchanted super weapon. You figured all that out just now? The point is we need to get moving. We aren't safe. Not as long as we have that amulet. I'll take it. You can't. I can, and I have to. Axel, are you sure? Of course not. But you'll have three wither storms chasing you wherever you go. Yeah, if things get too intense, I'll duck into the nether or something. I'm tired of always being the selfish one. You just go make that super weapon. I'll meet you back at Soren's fortress. Well, I want to go with Jesse. That feels like where I belong. Me too. But what do we do about Gabriel? The rest of you go. I'll take care of Gabriel. Are you certain? Yes, I owe him that much at least. Besides, I'm not going anywhere with Ivor. Lucas is out there all by himself. There's nothing you can do for him now. Everyone, take good care of yourselves. You too. Hey, Jesse. Let's try our handshake again, just once for the road. The griefer grab? You got it. See you at Soren's, all right? Not if I see you first.
further? Not too much further. No, no, we are not there yet. My butt's never been so sore in my life. Not that I remember. <sighs> Feels like we've been riding forever. I am telling you, we cannot go to the Far Lands. They're not just the edge of our world, but the limits of our comprehension. Oh, please. The Far Lands are a happy accident. Nature's way of keeping life interesting. No, no, no. They are perilous and unpredictable. Perlin noise, floating points. These are not matters to be toyed with. Hold on, back up. What exactly are the Far Lands? Are you being serious? The far lands lie at the very edge of all things, where logic gives way to chaos. They're a dangerous place to visit, and a ridiculous place to construct a laboratory. <laughs> Just wait until you see it. Do those two never stop arguing? You asking me? All I can think about is food. No kidding. I'm starving. Maybe we should turn back? This isn't the time. Swamps are too dangerous. You never know what might be lurking around. What was that? My stomach. Let's look around, see what we could find out. We mustn't linger long. The Far Lands are just beyond this swamp. So this could be our last chance to find food? <laughs> Potato, you're coming with me. Not much, but it'll help. Hey, Jesse, have you found any food? I should probably take what I have back to the group. Everyone. It isn't worth it, Jesse. Witches hate trespassers. Besides, 
There are plenty of potatoes around. Is that a witch? Jesse, we shouldn't be here. Witches are very strong. And they know these swamps far better than I. Ivor, I can't pass this up. I need you to watch my back, okay? I'm telling you, this is a bad idea. I'll keep watch. Just be quick about it. I wonder what horrible stuff's been brewed in there. A potion of leaping. Cool! Ivor. I thought he was with you. I don't know. He disappeared outside the witch's hut. Curse that fool of a man. Come on! 